Ladies and gentlemen, we got some news for you. Our brand new Jump Cut shirt is now available to all Patreon members. If you want to get it early, then go on to Patreon and figure out how. Yeah, it's very simple. And today, also shout out to Patreon. Shout out to Patreon member, Mr. Courtney Basinger, everybody. One of the OGs over there in Lowell, Michigan. Uh, when you donate over $35, not even over, just $35 a month, you get to pick where we eat. Courtney is no stranger to the upper tiers of our Patreon page. And today, he wants us to go to Buffalo Wild Wings for the Bacon Hatch Chili Smash Burger. You know we love bacon. You know we love chili peppers. You know we love smash burgers. Uh, I would assume this is going to be a home run. Courtney and all the Sixers, what an intro. I'm tired now. Let's go eat. Is that Derek Quack. Strong? Where the Quack. f are you guys going right now? We're going to beat us. God damn it. <laughs> this is awesome. What's up, buddy? How you guys feeling? This is great. I love that I had the camera rolling, too. That's amazing. <laughs> I'm about to do American Bagel Company. All right, we'll see you, brother. Take care. Bye, Derek. That's, dude, Chicago, it's a small town. He'll be on a future episode. That's on our short list of guests to have. Uh, very, very funny comic and podcaster. So yeah, yeah. Go check out Derek Strong. Man, I love this city. Courtney, you beautiful idiot. <laughs> Here's a review for you. We got two of the bacon ancho smash burgers from Buffalo Wild Wings have been acquired jump cut. All right, this burger's been out for a little bit, but you guys haven't had a Corey Wagner second angle on it. All right, we got the big old box. Let's see what's underneath. Oh, look at that, onion rings. That's what I got because I'm a man, big old adult style. Let's get those out of the way so I can show you the burger. And when we unwrap this guy, we've got a nice looking bun underneath that. Whoa, this thing is hot. Looks like mayonnaise. Those are the green hatch chilies. It looks like some sort of beef. Is that like bacon bits? Or maybe ground up chorizo? I don't know what it is. And then there's cheese. And then there's two patties and more green hatch and some red onions. That thing is burning. There's so much going on on that burger. I don't know what that meat is. It's, I think it's just like ground up bacon. Oh, there you go. Their onion rings are pretty good, huh? Mm-hmm. Do you want to trade uh, three fries for one onion ring? No. Five no fries? No deal. Ten fries? No deal. <laughs> Damn, this looks really good, dude. Wow. It looks fantastic. Can I eat it? You yeah. think? <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Bacon hatch chili. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. Oh wow. This thing's very good. The bacon comes through surprisingly well. Mm -hmm. I don't usually trust trust bacon crumbles as much as I trust the slices, but they put them on here thick. I was a little worried about that. And not too many burgers doing hatch chilies, especially mm. national burger chains and wings chains. But man, I'm, whenever they revamped their menu, I just think they knocked it out of the park. This is really good. I know. I know. It's huge. Massive. Very filling. There is a kick to it. Yeah. The spice is actually surprisingly good. The bacon's great. Yeah. I'm gonna make mine an onion ring. I'm gonna put some fries on my burger. Boom. Now I got a rodeo burger. Innovation station. Man, the hatch chilies, I'm be dreaming about this. Like, more burgers need to do this. Those are very tasty. And this is like real bacon. It's not bacon bits that you get in that little shaker can. Yeah, but like for salads. Yeah, it sucks. <laughs> they found the only way to make bacon not that great. Yeah, like how did you take the best thing and make it very unenjoyable? Congrats. This, I think, is my favorite burger we've had from B-Dubs. This is a messy boy. This is Sean after like six beers. Gosh darn, these are good. B-Dubs, you nailed it. I'm very, very impressed by this experience. Courtney, thank you. I don't know if we, this has been out a while. We only do like four fast food videos a month. So I'm so glad that we went and got this. Oh, this has been a long time coming. Sure has. For those of you guys who don't watch our uh, YouTube live, we had one where we, uh, you get to, if you donate money, you can pick something for us to review live. Mm -hmm. And we were gonna review this live, but Pete up ran out of burger meat. <laughs> I am so impressed with what they did here. Not only is like, when you read what's on it, you're like, of course we'd like that. But the execution is spot on. 
Every bite has everything. Yeah, they didn't half-ass make those. Mm -mm. Not one bit. They whole-assed it. Whole-assed it. Never half-ass two things. Whole-ass one thing. I have young blood. I am just like in a state of coma. Oh, also I got a new vlog out. Sean hasn't seen it because he doesn't watch my vlog. <laughs> yeah, were you waiting to say that? You seem like no, you had that. I just, I just thought of it right up. now. I remembered because last time I did an announcement for this, I was like, oh, did you watch that? And you're like, no. I didn't say it like, like that. You're I was like, like no, no, I, I never have and I never will. <laughs> and you're then you putting spit on words me. And then you spit on me. <laughs> but it's awesome. It's uh, these giant ass statues. This is one you should watch if you haven't seen it. Mm -hmm. Morton Arboretum, it's like in the suburbs of Chicago. They got these giant, massive statues that are like made out of wood it's called human in nature and they're, it's they're, they're freaking awesome they're so cool like definitely check it out that is cool this is sick it keeps getting better and better i feel like the camera just doesn't do justice uh, justice as to how big this is but this is just so massive look at that detail too it's so gorgeous That was sick, you should go to it. Oh, I will. Okay, well, that was fantastic. Ate too much, no big deal. Love how this turned out too, by the way. Look at the little number six of cheese down here. So sick. <laughs> if you don't buy that, you're a fool. That's true. All right, well, before we go ahead and rate the ba Banco, <laughs> that burger, let's do a shout out. Let's do it. Cameo shout out, cameo shout out, cameo shout out. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, we've got a cameo. We've been doing a lot of really fun ones lately. A lot of them are birthdays, but you can get us to do any sort of shout out you want if your uh, fiance maybe gets an awesome, um, what do you call it at work where you get a better job? I would promotion. work for you. Yeah. So <laughs> promotion. You get a promotion. You get a promotion and you want a shout out from a couple of idiots like us, just go to cameo.com forward slash number six with cheese mm -hmm. and uh, check it out. Just hire us. We'll do any sort of shout out and um, I'm sure you'll love it. You didn't know what a promotion was, and then just last week, you didn't know what a honeymoon was. You yeah, called it when call you it. go on vacation yeah, with your, your wife. wedding. I said, I've said that probably a hundred times. Yeah, I great. always say it that way because I can never remember honeymoon. I also because there's think... no honey and no moon, it doesn't make any damn sense. We need to come up with new terminology for That's it. That's true. It should be called post marital vacation. Yeah, it flows off the tongue so much harder. I think so I, what? it's very difficult. All right, if you don't want to book us on Cameo and you just want to hear us yell numbers at the screen. Tune in for this. Uh, out of five ancho chilies, how many ancho chilies? Do you give the bacon ancho smash burger with a side? It's like fifteen twenty nine before tax. Corey. Uh, so yeah, it's a little uh, overpriced. It's very delicious. A lot of spice that you don't usually get. It's similarly priced to other things that are in that same realm as chilies and Fridays. So it's kind of it's kind of okay. Uh, I'll give it a. I'm gonna give it a four. I think that was a really yeah, good. Yeah, that's a good score. Yeah, it's like everything is that price, like in all those realms, those like more like casual sit down spots like that. Um, that's like the best burger in that family that I've had. Like, I don't go to those places a lot, but everything we've done from like TJI Fridays and like wall burgers, wall burgers and things like that, I like that score 4.0. Wow, look at that. Look at the sweat just falling <laughs> off. <laughs> Put the air conditioning on. Do you want to hear us? Um, guys, we'll be back here tomorrow for a brand new video. Tomorrow's a Wednesday video. So, tomorrow's, well, it doesn't have to be, it could be Bandit. Yeah, it is Bandit. That's a good point. Tomorrow, uh, it's going to be fun. Thick boys, if you like the mozzarella stick game. See you tomorrow. <laughs>